All right, kids, it is time for the Sermon in a Box, and so I'm going to invite all the kids to join me here up front. If you're a visitor with us, what we do is we have one child put something in the box. I don't know what it is ahead of time, and then I look at it, and I try to come up with some sort of lesson about God or his word from what's in the box. So let's see what is in our box this morning. <laughs> all right. So uh, <laughs> the box this morning uh, we have a headless uh, figure. Um, you, I, I guess is a doll, and uh, and uh, and and is without a head. What are we gonna do with this? Huh? Well, that's an interesting one. You know what? There are headless people in the Bible, so we can do this one because there is a really important person in the Bible. His name, well, we call him John the Baptist. Uh, he, was, um, he was the cousin of Jesus, and he, you know, John the Baptist lost his head. And do you know why he lost his head? It's because he was faithful to the truth of God's word, and sometimes people don't like the truth of God's word. And so much so that they went after John the Baptist in a bad way. So, But what we can learn from John the Baptist is he said to us... <laughs> We're having all sorts of, of uh, commentary up here. Um, John the Baptist was faithful to the truth of God's word in the biggest way because he pointed us towards Jesus. And he saw Jesus one day and he said, behold the Lamb of God. We've already used those words in our service this morning and we'll use them again. And it reminds us in the most important truth and what John gave his life to was to say that Jesus is the Lamb who takes away our sin. And that's worth giving our lives to as well. It's worth trusting that Jesus has done that for us, and then courageously, even like John, telling others about the Lamb of God, about who Jesus is and what he has done. All right? I don't know if we've had a headless sermon in the box before, but we just did that. I'm going to send that back home. All right.